<laughs> uh, hello, Steve. Welcome back, man. You good? Ah. Bruv, I've got a fact for you. Did you know that cats are allergic to humans? Not all cats, but some cats. Cats are allergic to humans? Yep. So the humans get all upset about cats. Oh, get that cat away from me. Get that dog away from me. You got dogs, you got hares. But they are, they're allergic to, to, to humans as well. I was thinking about getting a cat, but then. Dead didn't. fact. The thing is, you can't put a lead on a cat. So that's no, why you I can. Dogs. You can. But you can't. There's and no there's, rules. There's, there's literally oh, yeah, no rules true, on that. True. People don't. Just because they mm. don't, don't mean you, you can't. You know what mm. I'm saying? Anyway, people, we are here at the Shoreditch Power League. Mm -hmm. We're doing another live take about. We're going to be joined by a few guests. We're going to have Adam McCola. We're going to have Miles. We're going to have Scribs. Obviously, I'm Steve the Madman. This is Spex Gonzalez, That's who's me. not Mexican. Come on, it doesn't matter. I'm Mexican today. And listen, we'll also be talking about news and results from the World Cup. Yes, yes, yes. So there's no rules. Tomorrow's show, we're going to be talking about all of the news that doesn't involve the World Cup. So make sure you lock in. Make sure. Yes, G. But just before we, we go further, there's no rules. Um, you was in Butlins with... Um, Small Nasty, a few Mondays ago. Can you tell us how that went, please? It was great. Obviously, sun, sunshine in music, friends, vibes. Got in a little trouble. I had to host a dancing competition. There may have been a girl twerking or trying to twerk. My girlfriend thought she was having a seizure. <laughs> um, but yeah, but that was about it. That was about it, man. Yeah, that was it. It was fun, though. Sun, sun and fun. I'm away in Ibiza again next week. Yes, sir. Can I come? You know, you know, you don't bring me. You want to go with this small nasty guy all the time, but bring me. I'm a big guy, man. Bring me. Bring me. I want to go. I want to see sun. I want to dance. I want to do all that I twerking and stuff. No, no, no? twerking. Uh, you ain't got the bum for it. Okay. You have not got the bum for it. Okay. Anyway, bro. Before I continue, obviously Nigeria. Musa is that how you say his name? Musa. Allow that. I've been seeing a lot of juju, a lot of juju, and I don't like that. Mr. Ball, Mr. Penalty, Mr. Penalty, and the guy misses. I don't like that, bro. Listen, You're bringing witchcraft into football, and that's not good, bro. There's no rules, man. How was it, though? I see you watching it with, with some friends and that. Yeah, we, we watched the game. I watched the game with my family. People came over from Somalia as well. So it was great. Uh, but obviously, I made a big mistake. I said Nigeria weren't going to score at this World Cup. And Ahmed Musa had other ideas. So I got chased by a few toddlers yeah. in my area. You yeah. sure they were toddlers? Yeah, they were big you toddlers, see their passport? Man. Huh? You see their passport? I don't know. I was too fast. I'm very quick, so I left them, man. You know what I mean? But yeah, you've enjoyed it. You think Nigeria could do well now? I think Nigeria now. I think Nigeria, Senegal, definitely third place playoff. Right. right. On with the comments. I love the. I love reading the comments. I love the comments you lot send in. First one is from Matthew Williams. Jamaica's best player is Usain Bolt. I agree. What a useless man. Saying he that. Said, he said Tunisia was not in Africa. No, but he, I get what you know. He didn't say that. That's not what he said. What did he say? If you look at the interview, he said he doesn't. When he looks at Tunisia, Egypt, he doesn't think Africa. Because when we think Africa, we think, like, darker skin. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah? Well, I still disagree. I was going to say purple skin there, but you're... you're no, you're, I'm silver. 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 Um, next one's from Tony Alexander Belagond. Oh, my God. You say it's no rules. Okay, it's no words for how bad the song was this week. I want to be the only one to hold you. But I'm going to... B.B. Winans and um, Eternal. Look at this, you, know, you had it on record. Look at you. That's a big tune. Now you deserve a mention. My Lord, you do. <laughs> yeah. But the thing is, I didn't sing it alone. I sang it with a few guests, so I, I, I shouldn't take the L on this. I mean, Mohammed, Somalia are going to win the World Cup 2030. The only way you're going to win the World Cup 2030 if you host it in Kilburn Highroad. Lot That's smiling, the only lot way. Of there, there? But yeah, a lot, they're, lot, they're lot. Own food shops. No, they've got a lot in there, Cavs, that sell a lot of sticks. Okay, okay. Back up, stop laughing. Sticks are serious when it comes to Somalian culture. <laughs> Stick your pepper sauce and you get a pepper stick. <laughs> Next one is from MC Jacob. Dead is MC name. Um, more time, I don't even think this backer person is real. He spelled backer wrong. Backer is B A K R. Backer. It's backer. Think of a chicken. Mm. Yeah. Buk, yep, that's it. Buk, 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 buk. It's chicken. So yeah, you, so you, but slow it down. Yeah. Take the tone down as well. Go a bit deeper. Um, yes, this one's from LJ Star. Janaira sounds like a disease. So what happened last week? Uh, mileage, Mr. Miles didn't comb his hair. So he decided to say that Jamaica and Nigeria should combine uh, and be a team and call themselves Janaira. 
So it's Nigeria and Jamaica. And Scribs was furious with him. Manny Loy. Allow, allow man like Mitch. He's doing his thing out there. We keep getting on to Mitch. But it's too long. I ain't seen him for so... I messaged him yesterday. Like, how's things? How's it going? And he replies, hi. I don't like that, Mitch. I spoke to him yesterday. He's enjoying life. Every time he says something, he says, oh, don't, 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 no one. Don't. <laughs> Secret, innit? Secret. He's become James Bond. Ah, oh, damn it. I was just going to say, say it, told me not to say. But yeah, man, Mitch is having the time of his life. Come back, Mitch. Come back. Steve, I don't know what I'm hearing, but they need to turn the volume down because it's not Afrobeats. Ain't it a train? That's a train. What do you mean it's a train? What you're hearing? You thought, man thought it was music. It's a train. <laughs> this is that's this like, is that's that Afrobeat sound. Sound like train that's music. Not Afrobeat. This is Dal Seems music when he comes out in Street Fighter. Bro, last one. Uh, this one is from Soldier Man Seven Seven Seven. Miles has no calves. It's an L. Have you seen his legs? Yeah. His legs look like arms. Bro, I'll be honest with you, and I, I say this all the time, and there's no offense to Miles. Lovely lad. Lovely, lovely guy. But he's weird. Mm. Like he's weird looking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He just asked me what does STMM stand for. Yeah, that's that's. He goes, Steve on a madman. He goes, what's STMM stand for? I said, bro, man. I said, bro. You know that one's there. Yeah, he's a bit, he's a bit weird. And he, he thinks he looks really, really gorgeous. This, one, this is the, that, that, That's the weird thing. I don't think, mm. like, for instance, his calves. He wore mm. today, he wore tight. And you've mentioned it. <laughs> yeah, of course. He, he wore tight jeans. Mm. They didn't even look like tight jeans. No, no, no. The, did you see the jeans? It had little rips in it. They had the Madhouse label on them. So, bro. You good? I'm all good, I'm feeling good today, man. You? We're gonna break down some of the stories from the World Cup so far. Mm -hmm. But we're gonna bring out a guest. We are going to bring out Little Scribs. Oh, so Little Scribs. Man's got his hairy chest out. Come on, bruv. Typical Jamaican. Hey, with a tight booty, come on. Your back up's getting bigger. Park that tight booty down. <laughs> you good? Yeah, my bro. It's like an Oreo. What is that, though? Don't shake a hand like that. You swap mics and you shake properly. All right, Uncle Steve. <laughs> so we are joined by Little Scribs. How are you doing? Mm, I got hay fever. You got hay fever. Yeah, I allow that. I don't want to catch no you hay can't fever. Can't catch hay fever. It's not contagious. You sure? What is hay fever? Everyone keeps talking about hay fever. You're allergic to pollen. Pollen, but yeah. there's no. I don't yeah, see yeah, no. There's no pollen. I don't, I don't think it's visible like that. Huh? It's trash. I'm a big man. I'm allergic to pollen. Let's not talk about it. Okay, cool. cool. You enjoyed the World Cup. I'm alright. Yeah, it's good. Yes. Yeah, man. Been watching many of the games. Yeah, England look like they have a better chance. So I'm gonna be a glory hunter today. They look like they have a good chance. Oh, no, 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 no. Thank no, you, no, go. No, go no, on. No. Steve, I'll tell him. Tell him what I'm about to say. Well, I think you're about to say you was cussing England before. Exactly. And yeah, okay. Typical, typical black man. That's what yeah, I'm, I'm gonna say it, but you know what? I can cuss everyone, and that's a good thing. So you cuss England. You tore England yeah, into pieces. Tore them last week, and now. You've come in and said, uh, yeah, I'm happy with England to do what I can do. <laughs> we don't say I'm happy with England, but I'm disappointed <laughs> with everyone. And because I'm disappointed with everyone, I feel like everyone's got a chance. An uh, ongoing theme in this World Cup is that the top players are actually turning up when their teams need them. Except Messi. Except Messi. Yeah. <laughs> That's for real. Except Messi. But mm. Ronaldo's done it. Harry Kane's done it. Lukaku's done it. Ma Lukaku. Lukaku. Romelu. Romelu. R Romelu. No rules. Um, no rules. No yeah. Rules. And who done it last night? Tony Cruz, Tony man. Cruz. Although Tony Cruz, for me, when he when he stepped up, mm. like Ronaldo, when Ronaldo stepped up a few, uh, week back, I thought, yeah, this can happen. When Tony, I knew he's got technique. I know he's a bad boy player, but he's always been a player that sort of does his job and mm. he goes unnoticed. Yeah, yeah. This time he stood up. He, he had to be up. stand up and he, and he did, man. What do you think about them dropping Ozil? I'm not mad. You know me. I, I feel that I, that's, that's it's a great decision for me. The fact that Leroy Sane is not there and he's there for me, it's crazy anyway. like what? I know he should be. They should both be there. I'm not saying he shouldn't be there. Yeah. Sweden won him up. Yeah. Um, and we thought... Right. Germany are going home. Germany are going home. Yeah. So now Sweden turned it around. <laughs> Do you think now they can go straight to the final? Be honest. Just, Germany turned it around. Yeah. No. They can't. They were poor. Very poor. Mexico. Very poor. Mexico. Yeah. Germany are lucky. But can't they get? Because like, they got Korea. They got Korea next, so they're going through by default. I'll be honest, mate. Because Mexico are going to beat Sweden. Seeing the way those Koreans were crying. Uh, what's his name? The Tottenham one. Son. 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 Mm. He was upset. The people were saying it because. Uh, I'm not sure if you know, in South Korea, it's you have to do two years mandatory uh, in the service. Army. Yeah, so, but 
the only people that get let off of that, get exempt from it, are people that have done well for their country, uh, become super national heroes. So because they won the Olympics or done well in the Olympics or got a medal in the Olympics, that team doesn't have to do it. And, and he's one of them. So when he loses for his country, mm. he feels like he's let them really let them down. I might be wrong with that, but I think I'm along the right lines. So they're going to be going into that next game thinking, hang on, we didn't have to go to war because, because of football, but we're coming out here doing nothing. So the next game they're going in and it's going to be war against the Germans. Imagine that. That makes, the game, that makes the game interesting. But I think Germany, after that win yesterday, I think they're going to grow in confidence now and be back and potentially go to the final. Jerome Boateng was so poor. He's not a poor player, but he was so poor mm. that they done better when he actually went off the pitch. What about Draxler when he went off the pitch? Draxler's another one. It's like... When he came off, it looked like Germany... Improved. Improved as well. Leroy Sane should be in the team ahead of Draxler, mate. Oh, sorry. Oh, Sane, sorry. Sane, Sane, Sane. I'm to keep, like, trying to get on Dra to Sane's... Draxler's like, he's just that guy. Like, he, he's a shoulda, woulda, coulda guy. Should have mm. been world-class. Should have gone to Arsenal. Should have been performing in the World Cup. Ain't he only 23 still? Or 24 I don't know, max? But, um, so there's still a chance for him to get that But he's one of those... No, no. I don't, I don't, I don't Look really... Look at Bamiyang, brother. Bamiyang, by the time he was like 22, yeah, but I he think, was on the... the but you know what? The trash. That's true. Some, I watch Bamiyang, though, and there's things that mm. I see, and I look at him, I'm like, all right, cool, you've got bits. Sometimes, you don't see that with Draxler? Yeah, I do, but... I don't know, man. That's a good point, though. What's he good at? I, yeah. It's, like, what yeah. is, is Dra Draxler? Like, what is your dribbling, main thing? Dribbling, dribbling isn't it? Dribbling. dribbling. What do you think Germany need to do to improve? It's the players that they don't expect a lot from that seem to be like... Ru How do you pronounce his name? Reus? Reus. 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 There's Reus. no rules. Pronounce it any way you want. Any way you, the way you see it, pronounce it. Reus. Reus. It's Reus. not your name. Reus. Uh, so you see Reus. Yeah. Reus. Mm. Him. But if, 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 he, if he manages to stay fit, I feel like he'll be one of their main players. I feel like... Um, the Draxlers, the Urzels, their man there, they're not going to turn up. Muller don't even look like, he's, don't, like yeah, he's not going to turn up. The same player. Like, if he ain't getting the chances, don't forget, he's not a player that creates chances. So if they're not putting the chances on the plate for him. It's a lot of pressure. Germany won the Confederations Cup. That was with a bunch of players that w there was no expectations of yeah. them. You get what I'm saying? So it was a different team. I feel like when they bring in their superstars, a lot of egos, mm -hmm. and it just doesn't work out. It's not well, working out. Change, they need to change the manager, man. The, 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 the manager's doing the Arsene Wenger. He wants to be there for 20 years. Bro. How long has he been there for? From, that, from when the manager, from when I saw the manager rub his Aww. thing. Yeah. And then sniff it. And then sniff it. And then go and shake a next man's hand. I lost all respect. What was for that? Him. You did that yesterday. Now the team I have tipped to win the World Cup is and Brazil. And me. You tipped them as well. Yeah. Looking at them, mate. You know what their problem is? What? And it's crazy that I'm about to say this. Yeah. Neymar. I said that last week. Oh, did you? Yeah. What? I said that last week. He's doing same, too much. I said the same thing last he's week. Doing too much. Exactly. He's coming out to him. He's See? attracting four players to him, but then he's losing it. If you attract the four he's players, he's trying to be messy, but yes. there's no like Messi draws man in. Then and then he releases it, it yes. and then the, there's a man free in space. Yes, 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 yes. Neymar draws man in. Cut the music. Then Cut he runs the around. Cut the and music. And then he's back, he turns back. And he's supposed to backwards. You guys. <laughs> it's a train. Yeah. You guys are, are, are destroying Neymar. No, 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 no. no. I just feel like, fam, well, they're lucky they got Coutinho because someone else can step up. Yep. If they didn't have Coutinho, it would be the same situation for me as Argentina and Messi. And by the way, and that's why at the end of the game, Neymar cried. You know why he cried? It was out of relief. He's done so poor this tournament that he said, you know, like he got that in the goal, which by the way, big up Douglas. Douglas come on and dumb yeah. bitch, by the way. Um, he's got that goal, load of relief come through. At the end of the game, they've got the win. I think now he will crack on, but that has been the problem with Brazil. But now he, he understands now. He's cut his hair. He oh. had this big long fringe thing all curling over his what, eyeballs. What was that? What was he doing? Bro. Like, like, like I don't know, that? he tried something. He yeah, tried he something, it doesn't that always out. work. Steve when he tried something before. Steve on scripts, I non agree with you guys, man. Really? Yeah. So what, you think he's done well? You think Neymar's do, done do, well? Do, do, do you know what it is? I don't think I think if you're if you're trying, I can't knock you. If you're doing see what like Messi, for me, when I watch Messi, he's, he just he's not doing anything. He's not trying, he's just walking around. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I'm I'm not interested. I don't want to view that. Mm. But with Neymar, he's trying. And it's not working for him, like, yeah. obviously, he tried to bend the ball top corner, it went wide, and he's trying. Amazing but the good checkers. thing about him is resilience. Yeah, I don't know, oh, I love resilience. him. Resilience. I love the kid. To finish off with a rainbow flick and a goal, that shows me that you okay. are class. He's getting treated unfairly, he's getting kicked shreds out of him, yeah? Chunks, mm. chunks, well, chunks out of him. What do you expect? But, 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 when things ain't going well for you, the first thing they say to you is you simplify your game. Mm. You don't start doing Aussie flicks, yeah. rainbow flicks. And it wastes time, sometimes I've seen the pass. And it needs to be made quickly. 
But then doing he, all this he, stuff, man. Like, touches, and then he probably releases it too late, and it's like, why? What you said though, Specs, you said you're liking it because he's trying, mm. yeah? Can't I'm, not the saying, trying. I'm not saying mm. he's trying too hard. Okay. So I'm not saying, yeah. listen, I'm lo he wants to do all, he loves Brazil. Mm. And by the way, his record, I think he's on 57 goals or something mm. like that, or 50. He's been involved in like, uh, yeah, like bro, seven, he's, like he's doing bits. Goals in 15 but games. imagine he breaks, he's now that. third. I think he's third behind Pele and then Ronaldo, right? If he breaks them records, which he's about 15 goals off, without winning a, a World Cup, I don't know, man. It would be kind of strange he to me, man. He cares about breaking that record more than he does he winning does. anything. I think he does. Man. Don't forget, he break that record, but he's been playing that wide as well. So, yeah. and boys, I'm what, impressed. What about, what about up top, though? Up top, I mean, it's like Brazil, don't know. I mean, growing up watching Brazil, you know, you saw the Ronaldo's, you saw the Romario's, you had that striker that you know was playing every game of the World Cup that was a good striker for the World Cup. Yes. But now it's like, well, I'm looking at Jesus. I'm looking at Jesus. Mm. I, I don't think he's totally fit. Mm -hmm. Still looking like everything he's doing, you see, he's doing little touch. Even the goal come from him trying to do a touch in the mm -hmm. box and turn. He's doing too much, isn't yeah, he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it drops mm -hmm. to um, uh, Coutinho, yeah. right? Um, but, bro, I would play Firmino. Every time he yeah. comes on, he's doing the thing which we said we put him in the team for. He's tackling, like, like, like he's, he's coming on, he's being. With <laughs> them teeth. Bro, bro, he's mm -hmm. being a very big. Teeth. <laughs> teeth are mad. And he's, I thought he said he's being a teeth. No, with his teeth. All oh, right, because he was teeth in the ball of defenders. Trust me, <laughs> the way he gets in front of him nips it. I'll start him now just to change it up, man. I'll start Douglas Costa as well. I'll I'll start. Like Willie Ann is. Mm, I like Willie Ann. I like Willie Ann, but he plays, he looks the best when everyone else is playing. You guys said Brazil, obviously your favourites. They've got Serbia next. And you know what? If they don't win, we just see they, they can go home. And that would be a disgusting L. If Brazil go home, I feel like the teams that have least expectations are doing better, and the yes. teams have a lot of expectations. Yes. Like yes, even yes, Brazil, yes. I feel like a lot of it's arrogance. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I feel like that can be the undoing against Korea because they can go play Korea and think we're, we're sick, we're way better than this team. They start missing silly chances, losing the ball for no reason, and then Korea can just be organised and win. But I feel like that's a lot of the big teams' problems. Yeah. yeah. Arrogance, mm -hmm. too much confidence. They which feel I like think they don't have to work hard. Which will probably put in it be in England's favour this yeah. year. Yeah, and that's why I said I feel like England have a, like a chance. Not because England are great, but because everyone's everyone that I expected to do well has underperformed for me personally. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? And the little teams look like the big teams. Before I wrap up and make you go away, who do you think is going to win the World Cup now? <sighs> I'll say Brazil because they've got too much talent. Still, still Brazil. Okay. Thank you. That was Scribs, bro. Scribs, my bro. Probably, come on. Nya, yes. Nya. With my hay fever. My brother. Nya. Big up Nya. Scribs, everyone. Mate. He's got a lot of cream on his face for some reason. It's all mad. What? You didn't, give me none. you didn't give me none, though. Bro. Yeah, yeah, cool, man. Cool, man. Well, he, he goes on and on. Should we bring on our next guest? Yeah. I don't like <laughs> this guy. I like him. <laughs> Steve O, just, just stare at his jeans. <laughs> We are joined by Miles, bro. Honestly, this is the worst. Stand up, stand up, stand up, stand up, stand up, stand up please, please, quickly. Look at these jeans, man. These are the worst, and look how baggy they are. These are bro. cool jeans, man. These jeans are Matting, cool, bro. bro. You good though? I'm good, man. I'm good. I'm good. You good? You good? Been good, watching the World Cup? Come on. I know you have. You enjoyed it? It's been good, you know. I'm enjoying this World Cup. I'm proper enjoying this World Cup. I can't lie to you. Who did you pick to win it? Then you weren't you Argentina? No. 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 <laughs> I'm sure you was Argentina. I was back in Argentina to get through to the group. Who was your team? I'm trying to remember though. Well, they team? might not even get out of the group now. Do you see them get battered by Croatia? Yeah. They They let me down. Messi let me down. But wait, is it only Messi though? Why are we all blaming yeah, Messi? Yeah, Messi. This, this is the problem. We are all blaming Messi and it's a team game. They got the, everyone was talking about Dybala. But Steve-O. Where's Dybala? He's a Messi. He's a big Messi I'm fan. I'm a Messi fan, man. That's the he thing. let me down. I even have to say now at this present moment that Ronaldo, he's better. He's more better. He's a better player than he's better than Messi right now, See? man. And that hurts me, man. This is this is why that hurts me. I don't tell him, tell him, it, tell him, tell him. Listen, hurts me, Ronaldo's man. not better than Messi. As a footballer, he isn't. Yeah. I agree with you. As but a footballer, you he's prefer not. Prefer him now to Messi. Right now, he's on form. He 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 turns up. He's won everything, every competition he's played in so far. He's won, and Except he looks like up. he's gonna win this. He, well, he could win this. He could. I'd, I'd want him to. I I wouldn't. Mm -mm. For yeah. legacy, for yeah. legacy, okay. I want Ronaldo to do this, just to shut everyone. Everyone wants him to do this, but it's not about Ronaldo. It's not. It's about Messi. It's and about do Messi. Do you think that when Messi puts the shirt of Argentina on, I don't think he cares. He's no, it's not about not caring. 
does he care too much? Is the pressure too much? Is he is he bottling it? I don't think he's bottling it because he's got players around him though. He's got Dybala, players around him. Oh, bro, Higuain, Higuain, took off Aguero. Aguero on yeah. 52 minutes the other day. That was crazy. If you're I getting think taken off 52 minutes, you're not doing well. No, that's yeah, but he weren't doing well though. I don't think. So the players remember, around him ain't doing well. But Higuain's coming on. Yeah, boy. So that's the thing. He's yeah, so if, big. If he need a goal, <laughs> you're gonna you're gonna keep on Higuain and Aguero. If you want someone to eat a pie. Then you bring on Higuain. <laughs> no, no way he's there, bro. That guy is hench. He's hench, he's hench. He's too hench, He's not bro. nimble. But Aguero scored their last goal. He's sharp. He yeah. knows he can make magic happen, innit? So why would he take off Aguero? I think it's the manager. I think the manager should be sacked now. After the first mistake, obviously, from, from the goalkeeper. The goalkeeper. Bro, that's now, what changed the game. Uh, that's what changed you. So you, when you, was there a time when you played football and a keeper made a mistake where everyone was just like, you know what? We're done. It's not so much, I just think, this is what you got to remember. This is why the psyche of football is so important because Mine. it's a re it's a reaction. That's like, that's like when a goal you get a goal, it gets everyone going. Yeah, one goal changed the game. One hundred percent. Either way, mate. So just like the other day, when the keeper does that, you don't. You the first thing you do is you turn around to the keeper and you say, mm. "I'm lucky." You mm. say, "Come on." Mm. But really, as you're saying it, you're saying, "Ah, oh, man." You're letting us down. We're done. No, not even that. Nah, because is, everyone bro. makes no, no, no. Come on, everyone Steve, makes mistakes, right. bro. Yeah, but, but that, and as a professional player, a part of being professional is when that ball doesn't come to you, you carry on. Like you, or when you don't score that chance, you carry on. Yeah. That's what, that's, that's a part of the game in professional. Like he's just knocking down doors, knocking down doors, and that counts with mistakes as well. So when a player makes a mistake, I promise you, you watch a you watch the players in the prem lose the ball, yeah. yeah, and then you go and watch people play five a side and lose the ball. You'd think that they're the pros because they go so crazy. Oh my god, you're rubbish. You're this. Yeah, but if, <laughs> if a keeper makes a mistake like that, and you're messy, you just look at him like. What no. are you doing, bro? No, he's Messi, captain. He's Messi captain. was the first person to run up to Willie. Yeah? Willy? Who? Willy Caballero. That's his name, the keeper. It's called Willy Caballero. Yeah, just make sure you see the Caballero yeah, very, yeah. a bit quicker. Yeah, a bit quicker, yeah, man. Come a on, bit quicker. Yeah, mate. Messi was yeah. chasing down Willy. Yeah, and then I. Uh, hello, he, hello, Willy Caballero. Can Willy we say Caballero? Caballero. Yeah. He got the ball just off say him. Cabby. Cabby? Yeah, yeah Cabby. He was, he was chasing down him. Cabby. Yeah. And he got the ball off him. And he went bang, threw it up the pitch. Messi was the first person but I know over Messi's there, mate. Thinking his head. This I rate Messi. I think he's working for Ronaldo, that Caballero. Ronaldo could afford it. I think he's working for him because it was trash. Good what Ronaldo are you doing, Specs? Spe no, no, wait, wait, Steve. Go on, go on, go on. What, what's he doing? Tell me. I want you to break it down for me. Anyone that is a number two and leaves a, to go to another club to be a number two is a useless trash. Number four. Waste man. That deals with rubbish. That's me. <laughs> that proves, Drew, where Argentina is, by the way, because their first choice keeper is dead. And the second keeper is the number two at United, right? It's Romero, dead. I'm guessing, yeah? yeah dead, he's bro. I'd rather him. Have they ever had a good call? Hey, Tabby Cats, Argentina keepers over the over the past? Speaking so of Argentina, though, man, they're, they're, they're moving me. like, they're moving like, you know, they're moving like specs. Mm. No, there's the Eagles. Oh, my they're moving, God. They're moving one sec. They're moving like, they're moving like I'm pigeons. Not, I, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm not cussing. Just... They're moving like pigeons. No, that's the Eagles. Oh, Eagles. <laughs> Argentina, hold this one. You pigeons. Steve, oh, these were the sounds we were making last week. Okay. I did the African sounds and he's doing the... Uh, What's that, Jamaica sounds? No, this is Argentina sounds. They're Argentina moving like a sound. bunch of pigeons. Bunch of pigeons because they're we not... All, the, the eagles are Nigeria. They're, they're, they're soaring. I'll be honest. No. Yay. What do you see more of? Pigeons. Exactly. Oh, like pigeons. <laughs> so, bro, let me ask you this one then. Is it time... Because I'm watching Modric... I'm watching even Mandukic, all of these players, when they come together for that Croatia team, they really look like a team. They do. Is it time we start taking Croatia seriously? They take them serious to a, to a certain stage. We take a few of their players serious, but as a team, do we take them? Uh, they've got, what's it? Kovac, is it Ko Ko Kovac? Kovac? Kovacic. 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 They've got a good team, Paris. They've got a good team. It's Very just, good. Just their names are hard to pronounce. Rakitic, Modric, Rakitic, Mandukic. Oh, I'm saying he's one of the most underrated players, you know. Oh, Rakitic. Yeah, oh, man. He's very good. He's quality. I used he's to buy him on Football Manager back in the day. Championship Manager Rakitic. He what was that 95? 18. What what, what? 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 What was that? 95. Football Manager 95. Hey, if you put your head in a vice, <laughs> looks like your head has been. <laughs> <laughs> Boys, you know what I was thinking? Uh, They've got a defender. Uh, I think his name is Vazalko. I can't pronounce yes, it. Yes, right back. He, I think he's class, man. I to buy him at 16 on Fort Manager. That's why I thought Manager's the best. Never lie. I'm playing it right now. Ooh, over the bar. I didn't want to get involved with the Argentina talk and try and nail them because they're playing Nigeria next. Ah. Ooh. 
So you, so he's, a lot of people are getting messy, but this is where Messi could actually turn it all around. He can. Hey, that'd be bad for the Nigerians, but all he's these Nigerians, mad. all these Africans over the years have been crying, Messi, 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 the best. He's the GOAT. You lot have a lot of goats. Oh, we, yeah. we, a lot of goats, a lot of goats. Excuse, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. You have goat. I've been to a Caribbean shop where they give me goat soup. Oh yeah? Soup. So that goat? means the goat's been squashed <laughs> into juice that you can drink from a cup. But I want to finish this because every time I go to Jamaica, I get woken up by goats in Meh. the morning, man. Yes, brother. Meh. It's annoying, bro. Meh. Meh. But these eagles, though, I it's a catch-22. I want Messi to go through. Do you, yeah, bro? because he's my guy. Uh, but at the same time, if, I if, the, I want the if the Eagles play well win, to go through. Yeah, That's what if I want. the Eagles win, if they saw through, there's, it's, <laughs> I'm looking forward to uh, it. Uh, listen, I love the Eagles, Eagles don't make that sign. They do, man. Have you heard it? Have you, have you heard the Eagles? They do, man. They saw. Eagle can turn. They saw. Round, it? Like that. That's that's an owl. Have you oh, ever seen an, an eagle with a saw? <laughs> no. Like literally. They saw through. They saw like a bold American eagle. I saw him saw. Oh, Black Hawk down. The Eagles, Nigeria beat Iceland three 0 Oh, sorry, 2 0. 2 0. I tried to add them to Gus's Musa, body. Musa, I'm saying Musa. Musa's probably the fastest player in, in, in the he's world. He's fast, isn't he? He's very fast. He, he don't look his age. Keeper don't look his age either. I had to keep him 19. 19. Very confident. Yes. Very, very confident. So There's a mistake in him, though. Yeah, but all keepers at that age. Look at David De Gea at 18, bruv. Many mistakes. I don't think David De Gea was as good and as brave as this Nigerian goalkeeper he's at very that brave. age. Think about it. He's very he was brave. getting crushed at corners in that, man. Yeah. It's about bruv, time a Nigerian keeper makes a big what move anyway. Will stop. The Nigerians, can they go all the way? I'm not joking. This World Cup to me seems like it's going to be an underdogs World Cup, man. For me, they can. They if need to be stays on the reserve seat, yeah, the bench. He didn't, didn't start. They didn't start him. They didn't start him. They played their proper kit this time. And I said the last episode. Oh, so what, kit they, what kit did they play in? They were wearing the goalkeeper's jersey. Yeah, you know? the third kit. You say it last the episode. Third kit. It looked decent, though. Yeah. And I, I, I said, like remember kit. I said the specs. If they win, if they play in the kit that everybody loves, They'll win. Mm. And what happens? They won. Steve, love you. Get off of our Specs. seats, brother. Look at the, watch these watch his jeans when he walks off. Watch these his jeans. His jeans are cool. Uh, he's got no trainers on. Woo! With a dentist. Hey, your socks Woo! have got flipping. Look at that, look at the back of his sock. Woo! It's got a ladder. Woo! Why has your socks got a ladder in it? Why are Woo! the back of your jeans green? Woo! The back of his jeans are green. Woo! My Woo! lord. Woo! Spectacles. I think it's time we bring out. Our last guest, got another one. Yes, bro, we've got one hey. more main event. It's the main, you know, you know when you're last. I remember wrestling, when you're last. It was the main thing. Yeah. Undertaker used to fight last. On Coming all the way from Bombay. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. My guy, come on, Adam. Oh, you good? You good? Al Aladdin's flown in. Yeah, I'll take the mic, bro. My cousin. Me as well here. My cousin. Sound up for hey, bro, sixty quid. I do love you. I love you too. I do love you. It's been a, it's been a while. You've been enjoying the World Cup. Yeah, man, I've been enjoying it. Who's your favourite to win the World Cup? It was before it kicked off. I was feeling Brazil, and I was feeling Germany. And then you see how Germany have started, and then Brazil haven't started the greatest. Not started too well. Most of the winners of the last couple of tournaments haven't started great. Yeah. So it's definitely it's a momentum easy, thing, yeah. and then they pick up momentum. Each win, they get confident, or you lose. But you I lose mean, confidence. you remember when Portugal in the Euros, yes. they didn't win a game for like three games? Yeah, or something that's like true. Three, four games, mm. and they drew mm. all their first games. Mm. And then they go and you build that winning mentality and yes. you feel like no one can beat you, you know what I mean? It's like a few results like that German result for them. You never know, like that's why I think that England result, winning at the last minute, yes. can build Massive. that momentum. Yeah, build momentum. It's happening, you know? And it is. It's happening, you know, Specs. It is. I mean, you're speaking of England. <laughs> of course, you know I'm speaking for Senegal. And Nigeria. Well, who are you speaking for? Because Senegal and Nigeria. You got Nigeria. me confused. Uh, you Very confused. Sometimes I lose Africa's it. a big place with uh, a lot of countries. I'm I'm all, all part of even Mauritius that's on the edge. <laughs> is Mauritius in Africa? It's on it's on the line. It's like I'm on sure Mauritius ours, you know, isn't that? I was Asian? gonna say that. That's no, Asian it's on boys. The, Mauritius is on the line of like you know what you know you know about this? Back of you check the map, Mauritius and Senegal, they're like this. <laughs> like that, right on the line. You check the Atlas, Asterix. Hey, bro, can I ask you though? Um, France, man, that's a team that a lot of people. You know, Africa team. That's true. Yeah. A lot of people were <laughs> they scared. Are. They were a lot of people were scared to commit to France on doing well. You know a lot why? of people wanted them to win or thought they could, but no one committed. They just beat Peru one nil. Um, wasn't super convincing personally. What's, what's your thoughts on France? Look at, look at, look at for me, it, when I see France, I think of Manchester United. Yeah. 
I look at Deschamps and I look at Mourinho. Yeah. And I feel like you look at France's squad, the players they've got, they should be doing so much better than they are. Same with Manchester United. And I ain't feeling France, I'm not going to lie. From when they booed Pogba in one of their first yep. warm-up games, never took Anthony Marshall. Are you mad? <laughs> I, I, did Marshall deserve to go? When you look at some of the other players that went, I think Lamar went, I think Marshall's better than him. Um, I know Mbappe has done very well. Usman Dembele hardly come off the bench for Barcelona this year, and I think Martial got 10 goals, 12 assists. Mm. He played half a season. Do, I think. do you know I think Usman Dembele is rubbish? <laughs> <laughs> Every time he just runs. Nah, he will run he's with tired, both feet tired, and just tired. run, run, run. But he runs where are you both going? Feet. But he runs with both feet, just dribbles to the left, dribbles to the right. He just runs. Now nah, he is he a bit. He's got. He's, nah, he's a quick. I think it's just player. when you go Africa. That's how the, everyone plays. They yeah, just true. run. It's true. Paul Pogba. There's been a lot of talk about Paul Pogba. How do you think he's doing quickly? He's a young lad with the world at his feet. Absolutely tearing it up. For the for club the other for the for countries of the he was a man of the match. He got the assist, scored a goal, and everyone was talking about how he was poor after the game, mm. not anybody else. And I think there's a lot of pressure on his shoulders, but I think he's a good player and he's yeah. I like Paul Pogba. I love Paul Pogba. He's a, he's a top top player. I like any player. I wouldn't swap him for any central midfielder in the world. Yeah. What? That's true. He's a United fan though. He's gonna no, say no, no, that no, no, Paul's not, that good. Like right now, obviously Modric, Cruz and all that are better than him. But pound for pound, when you got the when you think of the ability how long he's got left ahead of him. He's pound for pound the best midfielder in the world. I prefer yeah. Onini. Wow. Well, no one else is feeling wow. 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 <laughs> wow. This is amazing. England wow. just won 6 1. This is the thing. This is the problem with the English people, yeah? Especially your type. Yes, this might be. Because you moan. Taking our goals and are not proud. Look at them. You moan about England, say how rubbish we are. As soon as we get the six goals, yeah. you're not saying nothing. You're not Absolutely wowing. Absolutely amazing. I'm Do you know what? But it was against Panama. I don't no, care. No. no. Panorama. Steve, Steve weren't saying Panorama. We earlier. <laughs> Panorama, I'm it was you, man. It's a glorified friendly. I'm England. Listen, if, if my England shirt was clean, I would have been wearing it today. But I've been wearing it all week because I'm proud. What do you think of the performance? I think it was. I spoke to someone. I think Miles said it earlier. Like it should have been five or six nil. So it's like kind of England are, are are meeting the standards that we expect from them. Because if that was a Premier League team, we'd expect that England side to beat them four or five nil. So I think whilst it's a great performance and it's a good result. It's nothing more than that because if you get hyped now and then you go lose against Belgium, what then? Is it are you going to be on that big downward spiral? No, so I think you just got to take one game at a time. Cheesy, but you have to do it. And I think the goals that they were scoring today is the most important thing for me because there was no pressure on them today in terms of mm -hmm. the opposition. The pressure was within themselves and they managed to meet it. Um, and especially after the other game when they were missing so many chances, yes. Jay pops up with an amazing goal. Harry Kane's got a hat trick. John Stones is even scoring. So when the goals are coming from all over the pitch, it's time to feel positive, I think. Talking about um, the goals that they scored, they've done a set piece that, at, listen, it's against Panama. And when you do them sort of set pieces, the players of less intelligence sort of want you, 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 you baffle them, innit? But you still have to put it away. You still have to connect. Henderson's round the corner has to be perfect. Harry Kane's nod back has to be perfect. A lot of the moves that they've done is from the practice training. Now, I know Alan Shearer keeps saying, oh, it's practice, practice, practice. Yeah, we know Alan. Harry Kane's been practicing set pieces. He should have done it in Euro 2016. How about that? But it's good to see. No? Uh, no it's amazing to see. <laughs> amazing to see. <laughs> kind of. But against Alderweire, I don't care. Lloris and the man there. Oh, but they're not nothing. They are name, me, name me one Panama centre back. How England's playing now? Uh, Escobar. We could do, we could do Belgium. There's more pressure on Belgium in that game, yes. though. Because Belgium have this golden generation. Belgium have this team. Belgium are better than England on paper. Yeah, 100%. Belgium are better than most Premier League teams yeah. on paper. Yes. And I think going into that game, the pressure is on them. England are through. So really, if we lose, what do we lose? Nothing. I said first first episode, I told you. Yeah, you did. I told him as well. You looked at me like I was mad, like I was crazy. Harry Kane will get five goals or more. Five. He's already got like five, Booker mate. Like Booker T. How many times was he world champion? Booker T, I don't listen to Booker T. He calls everyone sucker. I don't listen to Booker T. So don't ever point at me and say Booker T. When you point at me, you say Bobby Lashley. He retired early. You lot can talk about Harry Kane. You can talk about England. But Panorama scored. In it. That's disappointing. They scored. That's disappointing. 
hey, Lukaku is going wild, you know. So when he comes and we and he's playing England, it's going to be a bit mad. I heard oh, they're what? injured. Oh, I heard rest, they're injured, mate. Who's the rest, bro? Rest the one that plays in China? Yeah. He ain't playing competitive yeah. games. Yeah. One thing I have noticed is the amount of penalties in this World Cup. Amount of penalties and last minute goals. VAR. 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 VAR's been terrible. That's been the worst thing in the World Cup. Got him. There's already been more penalties in World Cup 2018 than in 2014 in the whole tournament. Already, and this is a group stage. Mad thing. VAR. So that's why you got to take VAR off. But listen, the penalty today I even saw. Why you got to take VAR off? <laughs> no, no, you, no, you got, no, you, no, you got to take it off. You got to take it away. Let these referees make mistakes so I can get it else. <laughs> Ooh, no, not FIFA. He ISS. switches offsides. Off ISS, I'm going call him. ISS, man. No one can call him. But listen, look. This is, in no this is what I don't understand. Though. This is what I don't understand. We talk about VAR. The other day I saw Mitrovic get grabbed by six guys in the box, no penalty. So when does the VAR come? You know what it is? VAR still leaves room for, for human error. Yeah. So if man's telling you in the ear, e you, e yo, you might be wrong there, and you're like, nah, I wasn't wrong. Then you don't have to go to VAR. And it might not so it's the first. referee's choice if they go and have a look. Let me ask you this question. This is one of the things that a lot of people have been finding it hard to pronounce. How do you spell VAR? VAR? Yeah. How do, I, how do you spell VAR? Yeah. Because a lot of people can't Var. pronounce it. But it's V-E-R, it's Ver. Is it Ver? Yeah, it's Ver. What is it? Did I just say? Wait, 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 wait. The person, how do you spell V A R? Yeah, how do? You? <laughs> Boys, it's been emotional talking to you guys. Stick around, so we're gonna play challenge time. It's challenge time. It's challenge time. It's challenge. It is challenge time. It's challenge time. It's challenge time. It's challenge. It is challenge time. Yeah. Four weeks of hurt. Specs has been trying to beat me because he knows nothing. He will never defeat me. Hey, I've seen it all before. Mitch thinks he knows the score. It's a shame. Because mm. Specs is gonna throw it away. All right. Hey, yo. Right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. No one amazing. can challenge, thank you. That was thank amazing. you, thank you. No one can challenge me with challenge time songs. I hope you don't understand that now about Mitch, because Mitch done one good men in black thing. In fact, that was my thing. Mitch just joined in and ruined it. Yeah? Anyway, this week's challenge time, we're going to play some five man word tennis going from right to left. Everybody has five seconds to name a player who has scored at this World Cup. If you say a player who hasn't scored, you're out. If you don't say a player in five seconds, you're out. If you say a player who has already been named, you are out. Do you understand the rules? Yeah? Yes. From right to left, we have to name a player that has scored at the World Cup. Easy. Easy. Okay. 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 Easy. Starting with you, bro. Music. Harry Kane. Neymar. Granvist. Who? Granvist of Sweden. Lingard. John Stones. Christian Eriksen. Coutinho. John Stones. <laughs> you are now the referee. You do the timing and all of that, yeah? Right. Oh, man. We're going to start from you again, Miles. Huh? Yeah? The players that have been named cannot be named. I'm Remember this. that. I'm winning this. Do it. Go. Ronaldo. Henderson. Uh, we start five. with you. Go. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Isco. Uh, Cruz. Uh, Costa. Uh, Chicharito. Uh, five. five. Suarez. Yeah. 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 Scored. Five. Musa. Four. Yep. Woo. Five. Five. Four. Cavani. No. No. Did not score. No. Why are you doing this? No. I said he didn't score. Oh. Winner. Yeah, time's Winner. Up. Winner. Hey. Well done, Steve. -O. People, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And just to let you guys know, yeah, it's I no fluke. Name the most players. <laughs> Did he know? Listen, it's no fluke. It's no fluke. Yeah. It's letting you lot know that I am the king when it comes to football knowledge. Yeah, unlucky, brother. Yeah. I don't know how you much have much not. Wow. Oh. As always, people, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the show, leave a comment, like it, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification. Thank you, Specs. Thank you, Adam. Can I 
just let you know it's coming home, by the way. It's what, football? Yeah. I don't know about that, man. I hope so. Scribs, Miles, I thank you guys. Bye-bye now. Bye-bye. Take care.